I'm Terry Bradshaw. Join me as we meet the people, view the places, and experience the values and ideas that define our world today, right here on Profile. Technology that helps us do things better, faster, and more efficiently is emerging all the time. Here's something new that could potentially improve our lives. The development of newer, higher-performing plastic materials has brought with it many benefits, but also challenges. While these materials have allowed plastics to replace the once prominent use of metal, ceramic, and wood, Traditional means of bonding, such as screws, glue, and heat sealing, have not proven as effective. As a result, companies have begun turning to ultrasonic welding and cutting to meet their manufacturing needs. Well, ultrasonics is used for various bonding and cutting applications and can typically be used with any type of thermoplastic material. And a thermoplastic material is one that can be melted and resolidified. However, with the introduction of new, higher performance, high temperature thermoplastics, it's presented some challenges to the ultrasonics community, and Rinko has met those challenges by making modifications to the equipment and uh, higher technology tooling. Headquartered in Switzerland, Rinko Ultrasonics develops and manufactures customized ultrasonic welding and cutting equipment. Rinko manufactures all of its products in Switzerland, providing equipment of unparalleled quality to manufacturers around the world. Well, more and more we're seeing American manufacturers leaning towards automation to reduce costs. It also increases throughput and product consistency. Ultrasonics is uniquely suited for automation because it's very easy to integrate the vibrating components into an automated machine. Ultrasonic welding technology is based on the physics of sound waves in solid bodies. An upper vibrating tool known as the horn makes contact with the parts to be welded under force, causing the pieces to vibrate against one another at the joint zone. This friction causes the material to melt, creating a molecular bond between the plastic pieces. At first glance, it seems like magic or a black art. People are amazed that the parts become permanently bonded in such a short amount of time. The concept is fairly simple. The amount of force applied to the parts, the amount of amplitude, or the amount of vibration with a certain amount of weld time. Ultrasonic welding can be used in nearly any industry that uses thermoplastic parts and materials, and even some that do not. The primary markets have historically been the automotive, medical, textiles, electronics, and packaging industries. Well, different customers purchase ultrasonic equipment for different reasons. One customer might purchase an ultrasonic system to run a single part for many years, where a custom molder might purchase an ultrasonic welder with the plan to run it on one part one day, change the tooling and run it on a different part the next day. That's one of the big advantages of ultrasonics is that it's easy and very adaptable. Some companies tend to stick with older assembly methods such as gluing or heat bonding because it's familiar to them even though those methods often present numerous challenges. Using adhesives, for example, is a slower process often applied by hand and it doesn't yield results as consistent as ultrasonics. Ultrasonics is much more environmentally friendly as no hazardous materials are used in the process. Furthermore, the ultrasonic welding is more energy efficient than heat sealing and is considered very low cost as equipment can last virtually maintenance free for decades. We fill a lot of liquids into stand-up pouches and no matter how well we maintain our pumps and nozzles, we occasionally get a drip or a string into the seal area. Traditional heat seal bars have a problem with that contamination, but with ultrasonic welding, top seal leakers are a thing of the past. Renko Ultrasonics employs computer modeling techniques to design vibrating tools with precise amplitude. Using their systems, upper and lower process limits can be set on many variables, including weld energy, weld time, and weld collapse. This advancement has allowed ultrasonics to process newer, higher-performing polymers that could not have been welded previously. Ultrasonics can also provide data on product assembly results so manufacturers can verify well detail and quality. Manufacturers and customers will continue to develop and build new products. We are committed through advancement in technology to help support and develop those new emerging markets.